I am Dr. Sahana Deshpande. I am a gynecologist practicing from 15 years in uh, area of Uttarali, Padnam Nagar and Kanakpur Road. I am a consultant at Kanakpur Road Cloud9 Hospital which has newly opened its branch there. I am very happy to uh, talk to you about polycystic ovaries today. So the treatment modalities available for PCOS is everybody's concern because the urban population almost 50% we can see that ladies are ending up with PCOS in various age groups coming from teenage to reproductive age and menopausal ages. So according to the age wise we have the treatment for PCOS. In teenage all I would advise them is to change their lifestyle, have a healthy sleep and wake up pattern, have healthy eating habits and exercise pattern. If the PCOS is too bad they are having cycles once in six months we go in for oral contraceptive pills which is a cyclical pills, we use them as a treatment modality. Coming to reproductive age group, it depends again whether the patient wants to conceive or they want to avoid pregnancy right now. If they want to avoid pregnancy, we treat them with polycystic ovaries will be treated with contraceptive pills. Whereas people who are wanting pregnancy, for them we have ovulation inductions and if they don't uh, respond to tablets, we need to go in for injections, IUI and last stage will be IVF. So among all these stages, the continuous exercise has to be continued, otherwise the results of the same will differ. Next stage comes menopausal age. Even menopausal age ladies will have problems with PCOS, they'll have irregular heavy bleedings and people who are having PCOS will be exposed more to estrogen lifelong, they have heavier menstrual bleedings at the time of menopause, they may also have higher risks of endometrial hyperplasia, endometrial cancers and breast cancers. So they need to be evaluated for the same. So healthy lifestyle is what I would advise for everybody to avoid PCOS.